Today, I'm really lucky to have two of the stars of our upcoming production of The 39 Steps. I am playing three different characters, Pamela, Margaret, and Annabella. I'm playing Richard Hane. And only <laughs> Richard. And only Richard Hane. <laughs> Hane. <laughs> so this has been something that we've been looking forward to for about a year now. And um, Jessica, since you're playing three characters, which one is your favorite and why? That's really hard because I think I like a different thing about each character. Am okay. I allowed to say that? Um, yeah. Or do you want me to pick? No, that's, you're allowed to say that. It's true, right? Yes. Um, I think that Annabella is the most weird. No, I think Margaret is Margaret's weird. Margaret's weird. I know I made Margaret really weird. I don't know. That's, I'm, I'm not going to answer no, I think question. Annabella okay. would be the weirdest of the three. You think? I do. Okay. You do too? She's a little cuckoo. I mean, she, yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. She, I don't want to give too much away, but she is... It's like, is she, is she all there? Is she making She's this not. up? Like, <laughs> yeah. So yeah. I, I would say Annabella personally. Yeah. You know, Annabella, I think, um, kind of is the force of the scene where the other two characters, you're, it's either you're the force or we're in tandem with each other. So she's definitely fun because it's just kind of like, I just go and yeah. you're just part of my world <laughs> <laughs> and you got to roll with it. I think that it's really fun to start the play in, yeah. in this way, right? Yes. It's like the, those characters are so dynamic at the beginning of the play. And so it's really nice to kind of set everything going with her and the job that you've done with her. Has the experience been different than you thought it would be? And if so, in what way? And you can say more challenging or easier or anything. It's been more challenging, I would say, just because of the amount of lines that are yeah. required to learn. Is it the most lines you've ever had oh. to by far, probably yeah. times four. Oh, okay. It's it's a lot of lines. I mean, it's it's four four actors learning all of those lines. Yeah. So lines, I think I was not okay. expecting that. Okay. And and weird lines too. Mm. Like oh, it's yeah. like like this like for example, Richard has a speech, and it makes no sense. So <laughs> it's like you have to memorize something that makes no sense. So, yet it does, but it doesn't. I don't know. So the yeah. lines were the were definitely challenging. Yeah. I I definitely am feeling feeling more of the show when I'm done with the yeah. rehearsal. Yeah, physically, in my knees, in yeah. my abs, in my back, Oops. in my shoulders, and um, my wrist. I'm definitely covered with bruises. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, what about you? More physical than you thought? It is more physical than I thought, but. It's, it's more running than I thought. Yeah. Richard runs a lot. He does. Well, that's because he's running away all and, the time. And Peter Kenneth doesn't like to run, so oh, no. it's but, definitely been. But Peter Kenneth likes sandwiches. Peter yes. Kenneth likes sandwiches. And we sandwiches. No spoilers. We sandwiches. No spoilers. Yes. <laughs> no spoilers, sorry. I think something that will be different, and I'm interested to see how our audiences react, is Overshadowed is really known for walking in and having a... Set. Big set. Yeah. And the set with this has to be minimal because the concept is that four actors are putting on an entire movie production in a theater that might not be super high budget. And we needed to work within that concept. But we do have set pieces. Yes. And it actually was really thought out but simple. So I'm curious how, how that will translate. Yeah. But I feel that the acting is bigger than they might be anticipating. So yeah. it's almost like bigger humor, would yeah, you say? Yeah. Yeah, and, but then yeah. the sets are scaled back. Scaled back. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. it's a give and take. Mm -hmm. David is one of our characters who plays a multiple number. And we have a request for some Scottish. Put me on the spot. That's what uh, I, I said. remember the lines. Um, it's a terrible hoiling night, Willie. All that wind and rain rushing down the glen. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we open March the 10th, and we run through April the 1st. We have 14 performances. This show is perfect for somebody who's interested in improv, not that we improv on stage, but that has a little air to it. It's really great for people who love Alfred Hitchcock, 
or Monty Python or British humor. If you just love to laugh, I promise you are going to have a night of complete enjoyment. Till next time, this is just me and, and us talking to you from, from the, the wings. wings.